tips for Grizzly Bear. Firstly, make a note that all of the notes on this piece of music are all on the G string. And the G string is the thickest of the four strings on the violin. And you can get a really resonant sound in this piece of music. Pretty much every single note has a little arrow underneath each of the notes, meaning accents. So every note needs to be accented. And you can achieve this by accelerating the bow speed as you play each note. So accelerate the bow speed in order to get that accent effect. My second tip is that in bar five, you'll notice that some of the notes have got lines underneath them. And those are tenutone markings, meaning held. So what I would suggest in order to achieve contrast is to keep your bow glued to the string and go for a legato stroke at that point in order to achieve contrast. So from bar upbeat to bar five. Notice that the fourth finger, there's gonna be a space between your third finger and your fourth finger. They're not together. There's a little bit of a gap in between them in order to, to achieve that D. And you can also check that your note is in tune by playing your open D string next to the fourth finger. So that's a good way of checking your intonation. And my final tip is that in the last bar, you'll see double forte marked by two Fs, meaning very loud. And the last note is also accented. So what you can do in order to achieve that last accent is let the bow accelerate and let the bow fly off the string as you do that up bow in order to make that last note resonate.